This is Northern News from the Kitwe Newsroom. Your headlines this half hour. Unknown people construct structures on Kafubu River source. We can't allow uh, this thing to go on. Northern News. We begin with Indola, where some unscrupulous people have constructed structures on the source of the Kafubu River, which supplies water to Ndola, Luansha and Masaiti. Let's see what Mushota Mpundu brought in this report. The foundation for this structure is all submerged in water, and the builders for these structures on the banks of the Kafubu River have thrown all care to the wind and have continued building their houses. This is despite several warnings from authorities to desist from their illegal activities. The lifespan of the Kafu River, which supplies water to millions of residents in three towns on the Copper Belt, is threatened. This is why the Copper Belt Permanent Secretary is upset and wants a stop to such illegalities. We can't allow uh, this thing to go on. We can't allow this thing to go on. We need to establish with the council how those people acquired plots in the stream. Environmentally, that's correct. That's, that's incorrect. And now we, we don't want to put a department under pressure. Officials from key ministries in charge of management of water are on the ground on a fact-finding mission and they are not happy with what they found. We we'll drop a notice for them to seize what, uh, what they are doing. And uh, we'll continue with all these others that uh, we visited uh, so that we also save them with uh, this notice for them to stop the building. To break of uh, diarrhea diseases, not just cholera, dysentery, amibosis, and may typhoid, and many other diarrhea diseases. And that is going to increase on the cost of health provision to the nation. That money which we would spend in compensating these people who have been told what not to do, it can be channeled to other developmental uh, 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 ventures, aspects somewhere. During this tour, the owners of these structures were not present. And then if we go ahead and destroy the surface water source, it means that I think we are actually killing the town. Ndola City Council officials said they are not aware of these illegalities. So uh, it's entirely they were using, I think, power. They are using power which they have, otherwise I don't know whether they are connections or what. But for the council, I would say the council is not aware. Mshota Mpundu, ZNBC Northern News, in Indola.